Well, it's springtime in this heart of mine. When it rains, it rains, lemon sunshine. My heart's a bloom of roses, sweet and red, cause you're on my Well, mornings glow and time moves slow and if I am wanting to hold you The trees will sway as the breezes play as though to dance when you're by my side Then birds will sing and music plays as my head goes spinning around And when you smile and take my hand, I feel my feet will never touch the ground. And every day a new memory's made much sweeter than the day before. Yes, yeah, springtime in this heart of mine, and with you it will be forever more. For well, there's daffodils and golden hills, meadows full of butterflies and clover. There's rainbow skies and yellow moons and stars. It's a lover's paradise. And it's springtime in this heart of mine. When it rains, it rains in the moon sun. My heart's a bloom with roses, sweet and red, cause you're on my mind. Then birds will sing and music plays as my head goes spinning around. And when you smile and take my hand, feel my feet will never touch the ground. And every day a new memory's made much sweeter than the day before. Yes, yeah, springtime in this heart of mine, and with you it will be forever more. Yes, yeah, springtime in this heart of mine, and with you it will be forever more. So try me, and I will 
will come through Try me I'll be there for you Try me And you will see If only you believe Try me And I will come through of heaven my home in the sky walls made of jasper crystal river flowing by now the saints will all be there they won't think of heaven Lord you're the reason why you're the reason why Lord I want to go see your face Jesus you're the lover of my soul Without you I can't make it And I won't even try When I think of heaven Lord, you're the reason why Now some say I'm dreaming Cause they don't understand That you would build a city For the born again But the splendors of heaven are much greater than this life And when I think of heaven Lord, you're the reason why You're the reason why Lord, I want to go See your face, Jesus, the lover of my soul. Now without you, I can't make it. I won't even try. And when I think of heaven, Lord, you're the reason why. When I think of heaven, Lord, you're the reason why.
dream. I really had this dream. Dream to went to heaven.
don't have to hurt or cry with pain Just call out and speak my name And I'll be there You can count on me Yeah, I'll be there You can count on me There ain't no a hand and thank them for coming tonight. It's good to have y'all. I'm going to share a couple of scriptures with you before we close up. I love scripture that when you read, you know exactly what he's saying, and it's so simple it's hard to believe it. I like those. Here's a simple scripture in 1 John chapter 4. Verse 15 says, Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God. God dwells in Him, He dwells in God. Now, we, religion has made it so hard, but He just says right here, whoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwells in Him, and He dwells in God. So, if uh, you want to dwell in God and have God dwell in you, it sounds to me like we just need to confess that Jesus is the Son of God. Jesus is the Son of God. Say it. Jesus is the Son of God. Say that again. Jesus is the Son of God. Sounds to me like if the Bible means anything, if words mean anything, then that means that God dwells in you and you dwell in God. I like this other one here in 1 John 5, 1. Whosoever believes that Jesus is the Christ is born of God. Say it. I believe Jesus is the anointed one. I believe Jesus is the anointed one. Well, Scripture says if you believe that, then you are born of God. There was an Ethiopian eunuch one time that was on a chariot. He was a eunuch of, of great authority under Candace, the queen of the Ethiopians. And he was sitting in his chariot. And uh, Philip was called to preach down there and saw him. And the Lord spoke to Philip and said, join yourself to this chariot. 
And when he walked up to him and saw him reading, sitting upon the chariot and reading the book of Isaiah, Philip said, do you believe what you, you understand what you're reading? And the eunuch said, how can I except some man explain this to me? So he joined him in the chariot and they started in that place in Isaiah where it says he was wounded for our transgressions and bruised for our iniquities. And it's in Isaiah 53. The eunuch asked Philip, he said, who's this man speaking of, himself or some other man? So he started, Philip started with him in that same scripture and went through the Bible or went through that, that Old Testament document was all they had at the time and preached Christ to him. Then while he was talking to him, he said, well, what, he, obviously he talked about being baptized because he said, what does hinder me to be baptized? And he said, look, here's much water. So he called, he commanded the, the chariot to stand still and he said, here's a lot of water right here. What, what's keeping me from being baptized? Philip said this to him. He said, you can if you believe with all of your heart. That eunuch made one confession. He said, I believe that Jesus is the Son of God. Then he went down the water with him and baptized him. That made that eunuch born again. Now, the scripture says that Philip was then taken up from him. Just supernaturally, he was translated from him and seen, found later at a city called Azotus. And the eunuch went on rejoicing. There's a man that lives right down the street here. His name is Sam Tay. He's a pastor of an Ethiopian church here in Atlanta. He came from Ethiopia. And they're, they're a group of people that in Ethiopia that are born again can trace their lineage spiritually all the way back to the day of that Ethiopian eunuch when he brought that revival of Jesus to the Ethiopians. Now, that's remarkable, isn't it? Still, there are people being born again. And Sam's pastoring a church here in Atlanta, getting people born again. Direct line all the way from the Ethiopian eunuch. The new birth is a miracle. And the scripture says, if any man be in Christ, he's a new creature. All old things have passed away. All things have become new. I said all these things just to share with you tonight that the gospel brings people together from different backgrounds and different walks of life. Greg Nations is a great, great man of faith. And uh, it's right that we, from time to time here at Church on the Word and during the Word Wise Christian broadcast to showcase the talents and the giftings that people have. And uh, this man has uh, got his talents and giftings, and I wanted you to see them tonight. And we'll edit this down in, uh, in, in segments, and you can have a video of these songs. And, and we'll just use this as a, as a demo for anybody that might want to record these songs. You're, you're open to somebody else recording them, aren't you? You are? Okay. <laughs> so so uh, before we close up tonight, and Greg's had some physical challenges. I want you to uh, just agree with me. If you're watching this by live stream, just stretch your hand out. And those of you here, just I want you to agree with me. We're going to agree for this healing in his body to complete. It's already starting. We're going to finish this thing up in Jesus' name. By the laying on of hands and by the prayer of faith and by the word of God and by the confessed word and by the command of faith. We speak healing to this physical body. Wound close up completely. In Jesus' name, receive your healing. Rise up and walk and be healed in Jesus' name. If you agree with that, you just say amen to that. Now, that's all that Jesus did. Now, as we're closing up tonight, I'm going to ask Greg to, he's got that song. I love that chord progression to springtime in this heart of mine that you wrote. I want you to hear this chord progression again as we're... Um, as we're going out tonight. Remember, God sent us His Word to get our thinking straightened out. When His mindset becomes our own, peace settles in. Our soul becomes anchored. Our actions change. We become word-wise. Join us each Sunday morning at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time here in the United States for the Word Wise Christian Broadcast, and we'll teach some things right out of God's Word. Set your life free in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, pick, take us out. Good night, all.